With less than a week before a lot of schools around here start, the debate over a mask mandate continues to take center stage. Today, demonstrators took to the streets of Long Island to protest. CBS 2's Thalia Perez reports. My child will not be in a mask. My choice. It's a debate that has parents on both sides speaking out. Dozens from all across Nassau County rallied at John J. Burns Park on Long Island Sunday morning and then marched along Merrick Road, including kids carrying signs, all voicing their opposition to children masking up at school. This year, I really feel like we have to take a stand, you know, and kind of give other children and families the strength to say, this is our choice. Lindsay Sutliff's two children ages 10 and 11 are students in the Oceanside School District. She says no matter what the district says, her children will not be wearing masks. But Ryan Ganay, a Massapequa resident, has a different take on the issue and says masks should be mandatory in all school districts. It's your choice not to send your kid to school then. You can homeschool, you could do things other than going to public school. When you're with all these other people, you need to keep them safe too. Currently, each school district has laid out their plans for the fall, some leaving it up to parents whether or not to mask up, like here at Massapequa High School. Other school districts are mandating masks in the classroom. To mandate that these kids who are in these hot classrooms, many without air conditioning, and they're forcing them to be in it even when they're in the classroom and they're three feet or six feet away from the next person. But late on Friday, the State Department of Health announced a universal mandate inside all school buildings. So parents are left wondering if their districts will abide by the mandate. In Massapequa Park, Long Island, Thalia Perez, CBS 2 News.